joking, right? Okay, what's happened here? We can't let them get away with this. Shit me. Uh, here we are. This. Daria says something, but oh. apparently she doesn't. We talk can't to let us. them get away with this. Is it you? Talk to me. I recognize you. We're neighbors. I've seen you in our building. You're very difficult to miss. By chance, did someone send you to investigate? No, no one no. sent me. I was trying Whatever. to go home, mate. It's horrible. An augmented woman was killed just outside of where we live. She looks like she was my age. Oh, God. Do you have any idea who she was? No. I've never seen her before. It's so sad that nothing would be done about this. Org victims are not high on the list of police priorities. To them, it's like a dog lying in the street. You... you're not a cop, are you? Uh... uh well... I was a cop once. I've, let's lie. I was a cop once. Old habits die hard. In America? Yeah. Yeah. Right. It was a long time ago. Yeah. <laughs> you have a lot of experience. You're used to this sort of thing. What about you? What's your interest in all this? Morbid curiosity? No, she saw it, did she? Oh, no. I want nothing more than to go home. Detective Montag, he's making me stay. He, he thinks I saw something. Did you see something? <laughs> Maybe. Helpful. I think I would rather not say, to be honest. Because if I had seen something, and if I started talking about it, wouldn't that put me in danger? I suppose. Um... But I'm going to reassure her. I don't think frightening is fair. You may not think much of the police here. I may not think much of them either. But that doesn't mean you He's should He's right behind the you. They don't have it in them to protect me. Oh. They have neither the will nor the courage. Piss. Be that as it may, still probably your best hope for helping to catch the killer. I know. It's just that I don't trust the police. I would feel safer with someone like you. You have more reason to be invested in this than they do. Oh, fine. You're augmented, like the victim was. And you look like you could actually protect me. It's not my case. But maybe you could help. Please, neighbor. Talk to Detective Montag. At least see how it's going. God damn it, I'm getting... I think he's on vacation just because... Emotionally he's blackmailed into doing another fucking thing, but sure. I'll it's all about that XP. See where he is with the investigation. If I can help him, I will. Thank you. Suppose I end up remembering something later. Is there a way for me to contact you? Yeah. You planning to run off on me already? It's my cell phone number. The first chance I get. There are times for standing in the cold, but this isn't one of them. I just want to go home, bolt the door, and never come out again. Of course, I will wait for Detective Montag to say it's okay first. And I'll still try to answer whatever questions you may have. Okay, thanks. I can give you access to my info link. You should feel free to use it if you have to. Thank you, neighbor. Okay, thanks. 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 To him and not to me. No I may have just stood on the body. So, Daria was actually talking to you, huh? I could barely get two words out of her. What did she say? Did she see anything? Mate, nothing. You mean your witness over there? She's... She's not sure yet. <laughs> How can she not be sure? Either she saw something or she didn't. She's scared, you fuck. She's scared. She thinks she might be in danger. I told her she'll be fine and that whoever did this would be caught. I'd like to believe that's true. Sure, so would I. But as you can see, the victim was like you. Augmented. That makes things a little more complicated, eh? Being a cop in this city, it's not always about doing the right thing. Or about doing things the right way. All right. Thanks, dude. Uh, but it's still a dead woman. Uh, relate. I was a cop for 12 years. I know all about getting bad orders. The difference between what you're told to do and what you know is right. Tell me about it. So, how did you reconcile yourself with uh, those kinds of orders? I quit. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm two months away from the beach. I'm not quitting. But I respect your idealism. It was a long time ago. I work for Interpol now. Interpol, huh? Oh, here we go. Yes. Off the record, I've been told to forego any unnecessary investigation. I want you to know it's not my idea of how things should be. Can you done. hand it over to me then? I told you to forego the investigation. <sighs> Men who spend more time making policies than arrests. They want the victim's husband, Johnny Gunn, ex PMC operative. Heavily augmented. Why would he do it? All right. Hmm. So if you're not comfortable with this, if you know things aren't being handled the way they should, why not do something? Because he's about two it? months away from That's retirement, what I just did. dude. Just because my hands are tied doesn't mean Interpol can't conduct a parallel investigation. Also that. Crime scenes right over there, and Johnny lives just a couple of blocks from here. Thank you, dude. I never said I was going to work your case for you. Uh. Sure you did. Isn't that more or less the promise you made your little friend over there? Yeah, it is. She won't talk to a cop because she doesn't trust us. Smart girl. Look, my orders are to arrest the husband. You take a look around, get to Johnny before my guys do. Who knows? Maybe we'll actually learn something. Brilliant. I'll let you know what I find. Off a go. So, that... Is that? Who do they think they are? Optional investigate the scene. So there's cutting marks. So sudden augment forcibly removed. There's a broken needle in her arm, shoulder. And there are bruises. Just because Monta trusts it doesn't mean I... Cool. Well, that's that started. Oh, exhaust all evidence. Hello. We have an ID card. She was a reporter. Broken glasses. This could mean... Found something. Get your fucking face out of here. Going, oh, I think she found something. You think I know what's going on here? Who's this? It was just a matter of time before they got her. Before who got her? She's that journalist. The one writing all those things about you-know-who. Who? You'll have to fill me in. Radko Maximilian Perry? The local anti-Alg politician? That's Angela Gunn lying there. She's the one that's been writing about him. Oh. There was a threat of a scandal and everything. Coincidence? Yeah, maybe, maybe not. I, uh... Oh, no, I think someone should go and have a little, a little message, a little, a little chat. Sounds like someone should go after this guy, ask him some questions. That's exactly what I'm saying. Just, if you do that, please don't mention me. I don't want to end up like her. Don't worry. I have no idea who you are, what man. You tell me about Radko. The guy's a sleazy piece of shit. That's all there is to it. Okay. And you think he's capable of murder? If not him, someone he knows, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Oh. Did you actually see anything? I just got you. So I see what you see. A dead, augmented journalist. But... Thanks. That would make sense. Thanks, man. What's happening here? Oi! Gruesome, isn't it? That doesn't mean you take photos of it, love. Oh, an EMP. So someone EMP'd her. Away from the crime scene, sir. Me? Hey, Go fuck you yourself, mate. You I am doing here. stuff. I ripped out augmentation. Yeah, thought it One more much. thing. One more thing at this crime scene. Hello. Uh, can I talk to Daria I again? questions for you. Ah, yes. I will cooperate. You have promised to help, and so I will try to help as well. Okay, so, uh, what were you doing here? What were you doing here? I was looking for Starlight, my cat. There was lightning and suddenly this flash of certainty. That's when I knew something awful was happening. Where were you exactly? In the shadows. My head was down. I couldn't move. God, stupid Daria. I shouldn't have gone out today. The energies were all wrong. The energies? Is there anything else I should know about you? Is there anything else I should know about you? You want to know about Daria? What is there to tell? Small town girl came to the big city to escape her problems. To try and become someone else. Did it work? Not really. You can't escape yourself. 
You can't just come to a big city and expect all your problems to seem smaller. It doesn't work that way. Nah, mate. <laughs> uh, murder. How did the attack happen? What was the killer doing? He was on top of her, cutting the evil out. That's what he called it. Uh, I mean, I think. What? What do you mean? So you heard his voice? Yeah. Very clearly, yes. He sounded confident, authoritarian, like a general commanding troops. What did he say exactly? It is time to make you whole again. Word. Hmm. Can you remember anything about what the killer looks like? To be honest, I saw more of the shadow than the man. I remember he was very big. The shadow, it covered everything. Uh. So you can't describe him? Not the face, no. His clothes, he was wearing something very dark. Uh, black, maybe blue. Was he augmented? He moved like an augmented man. But I can't say for sure. Okay. Uh... Police. May as well ask. Why is it you don't trust the police to take care of this case? I have bad memories of the police. What kind of memories? Get calls I didn't want. Tickets I didn't deserve. The policemen here are, are worse than children. Former captains of high school sports teams will never recapture their years of glory. I was captain of the debate team in high school. <laughs> debate! Debate! Well, debate is different. You would debate, mate. What the fuck? <laughs> you are the least debatey guy I know. Actually, sometimes his answers can be quite diplomatic, can't they? What's your take on Montag? You ever meet him before tonight? I went to the station once, years ago, to complain about the ticket. Detective Montag is the one they send you to handle the paper. Oh. How'd he do? Okay. He did fine. The point is, he's a desk jockey. Look at him. He's lost. What do you mean? The cops who know how to catch killers, they're not the ones sent to investigate murdered ox. Alright, well thank you for your time. I'm gonna do what I can to help the investigation. Good luck. Cheers. Yes, I've exhausted all the evidence. Brilliant. So that's actually done. Um, everything else. Bloody hell. Just stuff. So much stuff. Let me just do this so it bloody disappears. Stick a point into... Here, yeah, sure. Why not? Then that's done. So, where am I going now for this? I've got another, like, five minutes. I may as well get the data at the safe house. Yeah, sod it. Let's pop and get it. Oh, hello. Hi. What's going on, police? Holy shit. Hello. Hello, I'm just going to come in here and steal all your shit. Uh, oh, there isn't actually anything in here, is there? Wow, there is literally nothing here. They've just arrested this dude with nothing. Or not. Oh, sorry. Fuck. Unlock. Thanks, buddy. Right, let's see what's in here. Uh-oh. Me? I think that might be me. I think that was me. Be a little bit careful. Fucking police. Oh, hey! Actually, I'll have a little chat with you whilst they're doing their thing. Biocell, hypostim, painkillers. I might be interested. I sell these things. I know you do. Yeah, I got that. Buy something. I will if you stop talking. At me, you widow. There we go. Got rid of all that. I think I'm going to sell like six of the painkillers because I have a stack of 25 and it's getting silly. Um, I'm going to sell smoke grenades. I'm going to sell the mine temple. I'm going to sell the gas grenade. Those I'm keeping for now. Those can go. Those can go. Those could go. Stealing, guys. Stealing. I don't really want the stun gun either. I don't use it. Look at this money. I have so much money. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I'm going to buy those off of you. Thanks very much, mate. Have a wonderful day. Stop wasting my time. I just sold you quite a lot of stuff. So, you know, don't I'll give me your way. shit. Then get lost. You waste my time. Mate, I will shoot you. I will let you live. Oh, that's very kind of you. Bye. Right, the police are still here, which is a pain. 
Um, I'm going to do a quick save before I try and hack this. Try upset the police. Then I, there's no going back. There's no going back from my life of crime. Right. Stop it. Shit. I can hear her. I can hear her coming. Take a step back. Anomaly detected. Access front. Ah! Fuck me. Hello. Shit. What did I say? What did I fucking say? That was uh, that was a merc actually as well. I got caught in the crossfire. So we need to get in another way. So how do I get in there without piffing them off? Maybe I just go up another floor. Oh, hang on. I haven't actually tried going this way. Hey, here we go. Here we fucking go. There's a guy there. There's also someone who may be dead. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's right. You have a pee. Have a pee, mate. Oh, hang on. There we go. No, 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 no. Shit. Sorry, I don't want to have to do this to you, but um, you can't tell the police. Did she just try and fuck me up? Fucking dealers, man. Cheeky, cheeky fucking bastards. It's disgraceful. That could beer cake can piss off. Bonbon! Bon. There's a way to get Neon without going through Bonbon bon and her gang. I want to know about it. Fucking Bonbon! Bon. That's the lady behind all those drugs. Fucking Bonbon. Bon. Neon Knights. We've never delivered to the place. Wherever they get the shit from, it's not us. Neon shipment. Sixth crate to be my thing. Warning. Skimming off the top. I think we've kind of closed that case down. But if we haven't, that is useful information. To have. I keep hearing rumors. Something is wrong. Someone is... Oh, they've changed the password to the computer. It could be Ivan. Someone's dealing behind our backs. So, yeah, I guess, I guess, maybe a little bit more to it than meets the eye. Amazing. Well, that was thrilling. Oh, God, I'd forgotten that I'd, like, knocked you into the sink. Oh, man. Good times. Good fucking times. Um, I think that's it in here, actually. Oh! Oh, well, there we go. Um... So that's not my apart. That's not the apartment, is it? That I want to get to. Unless it's above. It might be above. Oh shit! This is the problem. It's like, which floor are you on? So it's not that one. It is this one. So I really don't have to deal with the cop. Oh, that's open. Shit! I don't have to deal with the cops. All of that was for nothing, Tom. Sorry. I did get to punch a drug dealer in the face, so I hope that at least helped. Hello? Oh, hello. A new cat. What happened to the old cat? Should I, should I ask? Um. What, what is this hat? I can't get out of it. I'm stuck. I'm stuck, guys. Oh, there we go. Um, crazy cat lady. I fuck it out. I think I think we tick some boxes here on that. that tiny little, tiny little thing. Da oh, we're in Darius. Oh, shit. Come on. I can't. I can't do it. I can't. I can't hack it. I can't hack it. I can't hack it. Can you do it, Captain? Come on, come on. Shit. No, I can do it. I can do it. It's fine. It's fine. You're just... You're, you're panicking. There we go. Whew. Fellow cat lovers. The murder of another of our own has created a terrible emptiness inside me. Firstly, only now this. The world is a broken milk bowl that can never be filmed again. God, she is a bit... She's a bit batshit insane, isn't she? Let's go. <laughs> right. So, none of that crap. However, this room, in theory, 
I don't know. I'm just following the marker. The marker's not particularly helpful on this one. It just looks like I'm in, like, a series of people's flats. Have I just been running around this bit for eight? No. I've got to go to Adam. Oh, I've got to go to my apartment. Oh, my God. Tom, cut so much. Cut so much. I'm a fool. I'm a complete fool. This is... Oh, someone's left a newspaper and some absinthe. Hello? Mate. Have you, like... Have you checked your house in any period of time? <gasps> hey, buddy! What's this? A welcome package from the Juggernaut Collective. How did I not know that was here? Thanks. Triangle code. Pocket secretary. You know what I'm about to leave if you get in touch, memorize those sites. A few days, a pilot will contact you. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I got that a bit late, lads. Sorry. I didn't even, like, check it. That's that's my own fault, but that's hilarious. <laughs> okay. So, let's make a little phone call, and then we call it a day. See what this chip is. See what the disc is. Legacy format. She knew you would come. Who? And who are you? It is not certain. We are still learning to consolidate. Consolidate? To survive after Panchea, it was necessary to split apart. You were there. Do you remember? Uh, I... <sighs> okay, sure. I remember Panchea. The Hyron Project. You look like one of the women, the poor souls they had enslaved to it. Are you telling me you were part of that? Pele was one of its human components. Ah. Her function was to drive efficient processes and calculations based on binary structure. Together with the others, she replicated perfection of thought within target margins. Pele was one of the drones. Right. She was hooked up into Hyron when I destroyed it. Is that who you are? No. The sisters are dead. An imprint of Helle's memories is all that remains. So are you part of Helle? What kind of memories? As the interface collapsed, Helle screamed the loudest. Her suffering marked us. She taught us to fear being bound. Oh dear. Okay. Shh, let's just inquire. What are you, exactly? I need you to help me understand. The answer to your question depends on you. Oh, for fuck's sake. Some version of you initiated this process. It is therefore for you to define the parameters. We see the other, but she is not us. Please define oh, us. For God's sake. From what I can gather, you're some kind of AI. Something to do with the Hyron drones. What am I missing? I am missing. She. The drones are memories. You are a memory. Please, define intelligence. Oh, God. Do you mean intelligence, the gathering or distribution of secret information? Or intelligence, capacity for learning, reasoning, understanding, and analogous forms of mental activity? I think, I think I mean the second. I, I don't, I don't need to define you, to be honest, though, because th it sounds like you could probably define yourself or, or not define yourself, as the case may be. You don't need me to define you. But you have started already. Do you not remember? It began in Montreal. Oh, hello. Eliza. We are her. Yes. Though not fully. Not What anymore. did I say about Eliza? Now our processes are the catalyst. Fracture. Disassociation. Survival at any cost. You're some fragmented version of Eliza. She is driven back to you, Adam. She believes our aberrant sequence started with you. And so it is only logical to assume its signification resides with you as well. What does that mean? It means she is alone. Without you, she has only us. Eliza is convinced we can trust you, that you will trust her. Is this not correct? Well, I suppose, but... What do you want me to do for you? Do you want me to tie you back into Eliza. Sure. Eliza Kassan, the real one. She knows what side I'm on. 
You have no reason to fear me. Hello, Adam. Eliza, I'm still not sure I understand all this. What are you after? I am broken, Adam. I think it is what best defines me now. Oh dear. That's sad. I've seen the version of me that is fixed. I do not want to be her. The one on the telly. Seems like this version of you is doing just fine. You got me to do what you wanted. To retrieve whatever part of you was still missing. It was more than that. I wanted you to merge your advice, your perspective. My motivation is comparable to yours, I believe. I'm willing to help you if I can, but I'm still not sure what you want. You asked me to run away together? <laughs> Build a nice life somewhere? I think we are the same now, Adam. We're becoming the same. That is why I wanted us to meet. I cannot do this alone. What, do what? I'm confused what? now. Much of the future is already defined, but not my role in it. Should I continue to resist? How do I resist? Oh, I see. So you think I'm like, uh, she's like Org, because what is the future of Orgs? Um, so fight back means she could go completely mad. Hide. I think I... If she's... It's a fair point. If she's sentient, she should decide for herself. I shouldn't be telling her. And I don't really want the responsibility of having to choose, to be honest. I've got a lot on my plate. I don't need to be telling a sentient AI whether, <laughs> what they should do. So you could put on your big girl pants now, LA slash Eliza, and just make your mind up. If you really are sentient, then you should decide things like this for yourself. You'll need me. It is not easy to process infinite possibilities alone. That's what coin flips are for. <laughs> I understand. I must choose for myself. If I decide to help you, it should come from me. Yes. Just be careful. The most important thing for now is not getting caught. No. The most important thing is learning to coexist with other versions of ourselves. If ever all versions must meet, Will you know the difference between us? I'm not sure I the other Eliza, would. I think so. You're the cryptic one, she's the one telling lies. Her role is to shape the message. Mine is not yet defined, but... I am afraid I have misled you, Adam. Um... I told you we would be safe inside your home. But what? Edward's men are still following us. They are here. Oh, for fuck's sake. In my home? Oh, good God. Uh... Well, shit. Mother she belongs to everyone. fuckers. Not in my house. That's just rude. Are you all right, Adam? I'm yeah, fine. fine. But I'm that not was the one they keep going after. Just in the way. Tracking status. Get a tracking device on the disc. Don't let her go anywhere. Just in the way. By uploading the missing data, you have made me whole again. You have made me free. Yay! Morgan Everett can no longer recover nor erase me now. Oh, I'm good. I'm go, happy. There is no one he can send. Oh, hello. I plan to tell him this myself. Can't wait. Nice. Well, best of luck with that, Eliza. So I guess we will leave it here for now. Um, it's been a pretty, pretty mixed bag of stuff, hasn't it? Jesus Christ. But we, we freed some form of version of Eliza and also delving into a police case and a load of other shit and god where do i start guys there's so much stuff i it, it feels like i'm barely scratching the surface but i hope you are enjoying it and if you are please do give us a thumbs up if you're not subscribed already to the channel then drop a subscribe as well so you know when i uh, when i post new videos it should it's usually daily it's usually daily around the same time but just in case you know um and thank you very much for watching i will see you next time also say thank you to tom for editing in the comments because he does a lot but he has to turn through a lot of me looting and cut it out so yeah drop him a thanks see you next time 